So you guys know those TikToks that go, oh, um, battling this this guy battles this guy. Well, I'm making it, but more legitimate. So, for example, we're gonna do the Among Us crewmate against the imposter. But other than having literal things that go against one one of them to the other, and an advantage for the other, so we actually go off these five simple rules. Their strength, battle IQ, IQ, battle tactics, and weaknesses. So we're gonna start with the strength. The strength is basically like how like how, how strong they are, like if they can if they actually blow a good punch. Punch and all, you know you guys know what strength is. If you're not if you don't how did you go to school? The second one is battle IQ. So of course it's a battle. So you gotta know the proper way to like know if like if you do this, are you gonna be screwed or not? Then regular IQ is is basically a backup to the battle IQ. It's basically a backup to see if like if they have good IQ. Battle tactics. So battle tactic is that let's just say you're just you you have you're fighting someone and you don't know if you and if you duck, then punch. Of course, you need to have a tactic to go with you. It's like a, it's like it's like your plan of attack. And with that, with with the battle tactics, ta tactics, we also have weaknesses. So we're gonna go over the weaknesses. Advan there's some gonna be advantages and weaknesses to to both of these. I'm gonna use the red pen, the red marker in 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 3d in paint 3d so I could show you so first off we're starting with strength honestly being honest since it's, this is the imposter and this is the crewmate the crewmates don't seem to be that strong all they do is do tasks but when they're when they're mining like when you you can see crewmates they have guns they have a lot of guns that yeah so basically yeah, there's be there's been no gems in Among Us, so we can we have the theory that this will go down to the imposter due to them literally punching over a crewmate, taking out a gun and shooting them, and having the strength with their tongue to shoot through a crewmate's body. So we're gonna give that one to the imposter. Now, battle IQ. So we know that the imposter can go through vents. We can see on how the crewmates can can hit a button. Honestly, the crewmates have a have more an advantage to this one cuz they cuz they know like like they know like a shape of a map, but the imposter would know that too. So if we want to be specific all the way through, I give it to both because cuz they have their own advantages. Their IQ is simple. The crewmates depends on what the players IQ is the imposter's IQ is dependent on the player but the IQ goes with battle IQ so if they're gonna have to plan out if should I go into the vent or not the crewmates can be like okay should I hit the button or not and the imposter can choose if they can shut the doors so the crewmates actually get a tougher decision here being honest I'm giving it to both again now here's the battle tactics. Tactics, the imposter can vent, which would go basically go to the imposter. But the crewmates can have farther view distances. That that also goes in with the strength. It goes. They also they have a bigger view distance because the imposter would. Wait, hold on. No, wait. That's the other way around. The crewmates have a smaller view distance while the imposter has has a bigger view distance. Now, normally, this would be an advantage to the imposter, but a crewmate's battle tactic is if they are void of any vents, and if they're near the button. So let's just say you're in the hallway to security. The imposter just vented out. You're, well, not security, um, uh, admin, I meant, in the scale, on the scaled, and the imposter just vented. You have to run. And if the imposter is able to shut one of the doors, which, which the crew, you know that if you don't know like if you're gonna die or not, so, so if the, so since 
depending on how fast they can click, I give it to both because they because it because they know that this door would shut, but this one wouldn't. So the crewmates have better battle tactics as long as if the imposter can stay in one piece. The weaknesses. All right, the imposter's gonna immediately get one here because we actually know that they can vent, which is a weakness to the crewmate. What isn't a weakness to the crewmate is the literal button, the emergency meeting button. If they all know who it is, they're gonna they're gonna go for it, full on. The imposter also has a sabotage button, which which acts as another, which acts like another advantage, which the crewmates see it as a. If they if they sabotage like O2 or reactor, two people have to do it. I mean, not O2, but you have to go quick if you want to do O2. But if you want to be logical, doing reactor is an advantage to the imposter because they will just kill you right off the bat. So this basically goes to the imposter. So basically, using these, using just these three battle tactics, these three these three rules, I mean these five rules. We can conclude that the imposter would win by one to the crewmate, with their with they with them having defenses by their side with the with the vents, the crewmate having the button, uh, knowing around the map and having a lot a few weaknesses. So, it it's it's sure that you are gonna die, like seriously, like like there's no way of avoiding it. No matter what, you're gonna die. You're gonna, you're gonna be this guy. You're gonna turn into that guy. So, um, here, that's the full conclusion. Crewmates would be, um, hold on, let me grab this knife. Crewmates would be, um, Oh, let me move this thing 360 degrees. Where's baby? Stab, 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 stab. Up, up. Crewmates would basically die. They'd be basically dead. Basically. Crewmates would die. They'd be, they'd be stabbed a few times. You know, just... You know what happens to crewmates. They just get stopped a few times. Basically speaking that. Uh, they're going to die. Crewmate is dead. Crewmate will die. There's no way they're going to avoid it. The imposter. Which is right here. Wins. Okay, so full conclusion, imposter wins. Okay, have a good day, folks. See you later. Subscribe for more.